All right, welcome back to another edition of Boxing on Garete. Ladies and gentlemen, um, I have some really serious news right now. Um, James Ali Bashir um, has had a setback, ladies and gentlemen. Um, he's fighting for his life right now. He has got, uh, he's back in, in the hospital. Uh, well, I think he's back in intensive care. Um, he, his sister came out with uh, some statements saying that he, he's back in. He's basically fighting for his life. He's having, uh, his brain is bleeding, basically, and um, that's not a good sign. So um, please, you know, to all the boxing fans, to everybody around the world, please uh, should have uh, 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 a prayer for this man because this man's a, you know, he's a legend in boxing. He was a boxer. He was a great train. He's a great trainer, and you know, no one deserves this. Um, another reason why I'm making this video is uh, because of all the all the bullshit that has been said about this case. Um, there's been a number of uh, videos made by some people that I hope after seeing this retract those videos and delete those videos and make a retract statement you know they were out there defending what was done to this man um, saying that just because he was being disrespectful calling them bitches touching her face when you know he, that he was out of pocket basically and all this stuff well does that compare to a life being taken away are y'all com making that comparison so you saying that being disrespected is, 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 is as powerful as killing someone? Because literally that's what that man just did to that poor 70-year-old man. Basically, it, this man is fighting for his life over, a, over words, people, over words. Stuff that happens in boxing all the time. They are claiming that they want to be treated equally in boxing. That women want to be treated equally. This was a woman team, uh, according to Clarissa Shields. Well, this is what happens in boxing. People get riled up. People talk smack. Uh, chairs get thrown out. Tables get flipped over, like I said in my other video. You know, people get wild up at weigh-ins, at press conference. This is what boxing is about. And if you can't take that just because you're a female, then maybe you shouldn't be in boxing. Because I know a lot of female great boxers, and they're all for that. And they love it. So... If y'all can't handle it and y'all feel the need to put hands on somebody just because they called you out your name and you can't control yourself and you can't wait a couple of weeks to get the person in the ring or whatever, or whatever the case might be, then maybe you shouldn't be in the sport. To be honest with you, I don't want you in the sport. So I'm a fan of Clarissa Shields. I've been following her career for a while now. <sighs> My first video is, like I said, this is a step back for her. She's going to lose a lot of money. If this man dies over this... Man, I don't know how you're going to rebuild this woman's career because people are going to be upset. People are going to be upset. Um, I don't know if if any... I, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know how the TV station is going to take this. I don't know how Showtime is going to take it. I don't know how any other promoter or TV um, sponsor is going to take this situation. You know, like, do you want to bring that type of person back? And give them TV, give them, give them TV time. So, leave me you guys' thoughts on what you guys think about this. Personally, I think it was very wrong on their part on people who made the video defending Carissa Shields and defending the the uh, the way things were uh, resulted. And also, um, uh, also we need we need to hear from the people who actually did this. You know, like we haven't heard any statements, we haven't heard anything from anybody. So, but uh, leave me you guys' thoughts if you guys think that uh, that is fair. Um, basically, if, if it's fair for Carisha Fields to take so much heat for this situation, or if you guys feel that she has nothing to do with this and, and that, you know, she should, everybody should just forgive her and, and move on. Let me know what you guys think on this. I personally, like I told you guys, I don't think people are going to let this go. I think this is going to affect her career massively. Um, I feel bad for her because she is, in my eyes, a very great boxer in, in the female world. So we'll see what happens. Peace.